Good morning. I'd like to wish everybody a happy Easter. It's uh, beautiful outside. I love this time of year. Please turn in your Bibles to Titus chapter 2. And we will begin there. Uh, Kim and I are nine days into being grandparents. All of it, every minute of it. It's, uh, it's great. Karis is, uh, you know, a lot of people get up here and say that their granddaughter is the most beautiful baby ever. And if you know me, you know I'm not prone to exaggeration. <laughs> really is the most beautiful baby ever. I mean, she's perfect, and, and Kim and I cannot figure out, because we always expected that God would exact revenge on our daughter, Catherine, because she wore us out when she was a baby. I mean, she just was sweaty and mad and angry and hungry all the time, and so we just naturally assumed that God would pay her back for all that and pay us back, too, but her baby's perfect. <laughs> But uh, it is a, a beautiful, she's a beautiful baby. We like, we love being grandparents. And uh, my mother loves being a great grandparent. And, uh, but, you know, it, it's Easter Sunday. I absolutely love this time of the year. I mean, the Masters is next week. Baseball starts today. Um, final four. Yeah, very good. Very good. Final four. Um, you know, it's Easter, we can celebrate the resurrection of Christ, the, the plants, I mean, everything is, think about all the colors we're seeing now. There's green, light green, dark green, there's pink, there's yellow, there's purple. I mean, it's an amazing cornucopia of color out there. Cornucopia. Um, you know, it's like if, if wintertime is the guy in the gray sweatshirt and the cargo pants and the beat up sneakers, then Easter is a pressed seersucker suit yeah. with a pink Oxford cloth, you know, button down shirt with a pink bow tie yeah. and a yellow pocket square. And he just marches in. He says, hello, I've arrived and I'm fabulous. You know, that's springtime. I mean, it's just beautiful outside. Plus, there's like a coating of yellow frosting on it. It's a great time of year. Titus chapter 2, let's go ahead and begin here. In verse 11 of Titus chapter 2, if you're having a hard time finding it, it's just a couple of books before Hebrews. If you're having a hard time finding Hebrews, I can't help you. <laughs> Titus chapter 2, verse 11 says, For the grace of God that brings salvation has appeared to all men. It teaches us to say no to ungodliness and worldly passions and to live self-controlled, upright, and godly lives in this present age. While we wait for the blessed hope, the glorious appearing of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ, who gave Himself for us to redeem us from all wickedness and to purify for Himself a people that are His very own, eager to do what is good. I mean, the grace of God that brings salvation. I mean, I, I love grace. I, I am, I'm a big fan of grace. You know, uh, when I was younger, I used to know a lot of stuff. In fact, I, it, 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 as far as religion goes, I pretty much knew everything. I knew it all. I was that guy. But you know, I notice as I age, as I approach my golden years, or my silver years, I'm not sure which one it is, as I get older, I realize I don't know as much as I used to. You know, it's like, in fact, there's very little I know. There's three things I know. I believe that God loves me. That's one thing right there. I'm pretty sure about that. I believe that Jesus was raised from the grave physically. I'm pretty sure about that. I believe that. And I also believe in the grace of God. And I think, you know, there's a, there's a lot of stuff about grace that we don't understand. To us, grace is just kind of the prayer you say before Thanksgiving lunch. But, you know, grace is so much more than that. God is more forgiving than we can even begin to imagine. You know, because we get kind of hung up about that. But God is more loving than we can ever begin to imagine. I think we could say that God is all about that grace. About that grace. About that grace. No trouble. God is all about that grace. And, uh, you know, I'm sorry. Please forgive me for doing that. He said, don't do that. I said, you know, honey, I can't help it. You don't know what I'm talking about here over 50. First point today is grace brings salvation. 
the grace of God brings salvation. Grace brings salvation to you. Now that's a good news. Because we need salvation. We know we need that. I want us to, uh, in our minds, take a little field trip today, okay? I want us to all go out and I want us to load into buses and I want us to drive across the country and I want to get on the west coast and I want all of us to line up on the west coast of California and then I want us to swim to Hawaii. Okay, let's swim. Okay, you're in the water and you're swimming. Now, some of us are pretty good swimmers, I'm sure. Some of us are non-swimmers. So if you're a non-swimmer, if you're five foot nine, you're going to drown at five foot ten. Okay, as soon as you're water five foot ten, you're drowned. You're dead. You're out of it. Okay, you're not going to make it. You're going to fall far short of Hawaii. But let's say you're a good swimmer. Let's say you make it five miles. Man, that's fantastic. That's a long way because that water's cold in the Pacific. Let's say you make it 10 miles. Let's say you make it 500 miles. <clears throat> Wayne Cisco looks like he'd be a good swimmer. Yeah. He's long, he's lean. I bet he could swim 500 miles. <laughs> but you know, even if he swam 500 miles, he still is going to fall so far short of Hawaii. And see, what you do, you get in that water and all your determination, you'd be swimming and you're like, I can make this, I can do it, I have no choice, this is life or death, i got to go. And you would swim. And, but finally at a point, your, your determination and your willpower would be spent and you would just, uh, you know, but then that lizard brain would kick in for survival. You'd say, i got to swim some more. And you'd swim some more, another 300 yards or however far. But eventually, you're going to drown. You are going to fall far short of Hawaii. Romans chapter 3 verse 23 says, For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. Mm -hmm. You know, there's some really good people in this room, but you're still going to fall far short of the glory of God. There's some really bad people in this room, including me. And we're going to fall far short of the glory of God. See, but that's what God's grace is. God's grace is even though we're going to fall far short we're still going to be saved if we're Amen. Christians. Yeah. Amen. You know, I think this is helpful for us because on some level, we all know that we need to be saved. We all know that we need to be rescued. We all know that I only made it 500 miles and there's 2,500 more miles to go. I need a rescuer. I need a savior. I need a saver. I need a boat is what I need. We all know that somewhere deep down that we all need to be saved. You know, some of us, uh, well, we all have a side that we present to the world. You know, just the, the brushed, flossed, scented <coughs> version of ourselves that we want to present to everyone around us so that they'll know who we want them to think we are. I mean, we all do that. And I think sometimes church folk are more particular about the presentation than non-church folk. Non-church folk are just like, you know, I don't really care what you think about me. I don't care if you like me. I don't care if you think I'm righteous. I don't think if you care. I don't, you know, if I'm saved, I just don't care. But church people, we do care. We care a lot. It's like because we feel like I've got standards to uphold. I have a, a banner to carry. I have to be great. But we all know deep down that we all have stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And you know, there are things that each one of us in this room, me, you, 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 we all have things that we have done that cause us to just shudder. Yeah. Things we are ashamed of. Yeah. Things that we have done. Things we've said. Acts we have committed that just 